Okay, welcome back, viewers. This is Serpent Stare. This is Magic 2014, and this is uh, Absence Glory, an opponent. I presume this is what they meant by uh, vigilantes, zealous vigilantes, um, when Chandra was warning us about this area. Well, let's check it out. Yeah, let's keep going with the Fire Wave deck. I, I like uh, experimenting with new strategies. Using new cards. Card synergy, five stars. Oh, that's gonna be a bit of a problem. Sigismund. Does this mean I'm actually facing a planeswalker this time? He has small creatures, a fast deck, less flexible, lots of card synergy. I might have to spend a lot of burn spells and stuff getting rid of uh, vital parts of uh, creature combos here. As the mob retreats, a soldier in gleaming armor stands before you. I know nothing of this from Mars, he says, but I know that pendant. Prove your worthiness to bear it. Fail, and I will reclaim Avacyn's holy sigil and cast you to the dogs. Okay, now we have a torch fiend, we have a Regathan firecat, we have a firewing phoenix, and four mana. I think this is a decent enough hand, let's keep it, and I hope we draw spells. <sighs> Ideally, some cheap ones. Doomed Traveler. This is new. When Doomed Traveler dies, put a 1-1 white spirit creature token with flying onto the battlefield. He vowed he would never rest until he reached his destination. He doesn't know how right he was. That's some nice flavor text there. Okay, so if he dies, he becomes a spirit, and the spirit flies. But the spirit is also a token. Um, creature tokens have several weaknesses compared to creature cards, one of the uh, most notable of which is that if you have a bounce spell that can return them to their hand, to uh, your opponent's hand, because they're not actually a card per se, they just get destroyed. Um, and they also don't exist in the graveyard, or exiled from the game. So basically, if they leave the battlefield, they cease to exist, which is a pretty substantial disadvantage. Okay. Back to fighting planeswalkers. Another white land. Another doom traveler. Okay. I'm gonna get hit by, hit by the first one, I presume. Yep. Fine. He smacks me with his spear. That's reasonable enough activity. And I get a uh, Pilgrim's Eye Thopter. Not a bad card to have. Let's play the um, Torch Fiend. If you have any artifacts in that deck, I might be able to deal with them. If I consider it worth my time. The other cool thing about this is that if I had the mana available, I could use it mid combat after he like after he'd been chosen to block something. Gather the town folk. Two more white humans. Yay! Mobs. <sighs> are you gonna attack me with your two? Yes, you are. Do I want to block and have him get a flyer? No, I do not. I can't block the flyers. I would be, f no, I would be, f I'm not sure I would want to block the, uh, the tokens either, because they just kill my dude. <sighs> yes, tokens are also, uh, you know, they don't, they aren't cards, so they don't take up cards in your library, and you can often get them more than one at a time. That's one of the advantages of token creatures. Regathan Firecat. Uh, the Firewing Phoenix, I look forward to being able to summon you. This, on the other hand, could block something in the air. So it'll be good to have on the field when those spirits are around. Even though it can only block one. Pity I don't have buffs in this deck. If I could give that, like, an oaken form, that'd be really handy. Then I could lock all sorts of things in the air and I'd be fine. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and attack with this, and if he blocks, that's, that's okay. Are you gonna? Yes, you are. Yeah, 
Santa Plains. And Midnight Guard. Whenever another creature enters the battlefield, untap Midnight Guard. When you're on watch, no noise is harmless, and no shadow can be ignored. All Gord of the Skilled Folk. Okay. So he can attack with this, and if he then summons something on his main phase 2, then he can untap and it'll be available to block. Handy effect. It's like a conditional vigilance. Hmm, now do I want to block something right now? Do I? Taking a lot of damage over here. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's just expend this to get rid of one of his attacking humans. Yes, yes. Yes, yes, I get it. So do you. Excuse me. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Scargon Firebird. Well, if I can get that out eventually, that'll be nice stuff. You can also play the Firewing Phoenix. I could do that this turn. Then I'd have a pretty good blocker. Mm-hmm. Yes, I would. It could even survive one of these uh, token humans. And it could then block them in the air because it's a flyer. I will totally play that card. I've talked myself into it. As it floats ethereally above the battlefield. I don't want to block that one, though, because if I did that, they'd both die. I might want to use my uh, Regathan Firecat to block that dude. Gather the townsfolk. Two more plus one plus one. Plus one plus one counters? No. One one tokens. There's a difference. You're only going to attack me with that one. Well, I can take the two damage. I can deal with it. Slice. You're gonna... No, you're not gonna summon anything else on your second main phase. You know that would have been a better idea if you summoned these two on your second main phase, right? Okay. It's not, it's not Firebird time yet. But the time will come. The time will come, my friends. Next turn. Ne next, next turn. I'll have enough mana to cast you. And then, it will be glorious. Let's skip attacking for now. I want to hold back and build up my force. I'll keep taking some damage, but I can deal with it. might actually have the power totally take you down with this. Um, I'll block one of your tokens with the Firewing Phoenix. And I'll take three damage. I can deal with that. Yeah, I could target the Doom Travelers, uh, but then I'd have more creatures coming towards me next time, because taking out one of the tokens decreases his creature count. Taking out one of the Doom Travelers doesn't. Oh, right. Yes, I knew I was throwing that under the bus. I just wanted to get rid of that other creature. Ah, Scark and Firebird. All I have to do is attack you with my Phoenix first. And then it will be glorious. Now, in the middle of my end step, I will end this video. Come back next time to see the end of this flight.